Hola mis coneguitos, como estas mi amolicia? Hello my bennies, how are you? My name is Allison, and today we are playing Nancy Drew, Ransom of the Seven Ships. Hi, I'm Nancy Drew. And I believe in the previous video, we were about to talk to Cuckoo, because her perch is very similar Oh, nope, that's the signs. That, oh, we need to go through that. Her perch is very similar to the one right here. And we had to open the book in order to activate that task. Very frustrating. Detective Drew should get a clue. Ah, That's a really interesting perch you've got there, Cuckoo. Nice perch, nice perch. Cuckoo love perch. Yeah, uh, well, the thing is, I kind of need it. Look, how about I trade you that perch for an even nicer one? Treat for trade! Treat for trade! Cuckoo want fruit! 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 <sighs> Why am right. I not surprised? I've got a treat here. Now, what kind of new perch would you like? Treat first! Treat first! Spoiled brat. Sweet! Cuckoo <laughs> on driftwood. You want a piece of driftwood for a perch? Driftwood for perch! Driftwood for perch! Rah! Well, ciao for now. Find perch! Find perch! Alright, alright, I get ya. Now, if I remember correctly, driftwood is actually found in two, three different places. I know we can guard a sh go to Shark Cove. So let's do. Yeah. And what's really interesting is that. <laughs> I thought it would be the same perch for every single play of Ransom of the Seven Ships. It's not, it is different, which is really weird. Oh well. Uh, let's see if this perch is good for Cuckoo. Ah, Detective Drew should get a clue. Here Come you on go. Now. A nice new driftwood perch. Not right! Not right! Aww. What's wrong with it? No bark! No bark! Cuckoo want perch with no bark! All right. It's gonna be a little hard to find, I think. I'll see what I can do. Cuckoo want new perch! Rawr! Well, ciao for now. Bye bye! I actually do know that there's one place that has no per uh, no bark for its driftwood, but I can't remember where it was. Maybe it was Blue Hole? Let's find out. Ah, uh, come on, here we go. Would it be here? Wouldn't it be nice? Um, no, okay. Uh, there it is. I was right, it was a blue hole. Cool. And now let's see if Cuckoo likes it. Definitely interesting bird, don't you think? <laughs> oh man. Guys, I am so psyched. I finally got that book reading done for my main channel. And I got it uploaded. I only hope that I have the time right for it to be uploaded at my usual time. If not, well... That's just sad. <sighs> ah, Nancy Drew, what's up with you? I have another, I have perch, another for you. perch for you. What do you think? Please, Cuckoo, let this be the final one. Of course it's not, because there's going to be three times. Not right, not right. <sighs> Why not? <sighs> three branches. Cuckoo want perch with three branches. Alright, so she wants a perch with no bark, 
and three branches. I'll see what I can do. Cuckoo want new perch! <laughs> well, ciao for now. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Bye, bird. That's what Lulu used to say. Bye, bird. <laughs> oh, man. That Lulu cheese. Okay. Um, wait. Was the... Uh, was it over here? I can't remember. No, that has bark. We still can't go over here yet. Alright. Which is weird considering we have the metal detector. Oh wait, no, that was for when we were scuba diving. Alright, yeah. Um... Let us go through here. It's a little bit quicker, surprisingly. There we go, alright. Music is so beautiful. Alright. What is this? That's one, two, three, and four. No. Um, no. Eh. Really? Okay, what's this? No. I mean, that looks like it has bark on there. You know what, guys? Like, I seriously can't remember if these are the only places where we can find driftwood. So, I'm gonna cheat just a little bit to make sure I'm remembering correctly. So, this might be the one, but I'm not positive. I gotta go back to Shark Cove because I, I found out that there's another per, uh, another, uh, branch over there that I overlooked. Oopsie doodles. I can't believe I'm cheating already this early in the recording. Oh well. <laughs> Aw, never mind. Let's go this way. Here we go. Booyah. Okay. So, oh. Oh, hey, we found it. Awesome. <laughs> that was easy. Everything is awesome. Everything is beautiful. Beautifully done. Let's us give the perch to Coco. Alright guys, and I gotta warn ya, she is gonna get a little loud. I have another perch for you. What do you think? Coco love it! Hand it over, hand it over! Gimme, give gimme, give gimme! Give okay, okay, take it easy. <laughs> Yeah! Woohoo! New perch! New perch! Very nice! Now yeah. that you have a new perch, I'll take your old one, thank you. Finally, oh we get to gosh. see the... These headlines are about cases that I helped solve. Oh, what's going on here? Someone's getting a little... Pretty getting bird, a stalker. Pretty bird, pretty perch for the pretty bird. Oh yeah, you're a pretty bird. You're a pretty parrot. Like her grandmother pictured, right? I really do wonder if she's related to Lulu. I'll talk to you later, okay? Find bass, find bass. Rah! What? Okay, normally parrots repeat what they've been hearing. Oh, George has probably been saying it. How's it going? There's more to our mysterious beach bum than meets the eye. Why do you say that? All I know for sure is that he's been following me, and that he's been using a fake name and wearing a disguise. Whoa, that sounds a little suspicious. Why would yeah. he bother to do that? I don't know. 
yet. I'm pretty right. much convinced the Gibsons are the ones who kidnapped Bess in order to get me to find that treasure for it. them. But why you? I mean, you don't even know them, do you? Maybe I do. Maybe Gibson isn't their real name. Frankly, at this right. point, I don't really care who kidnapped her. Getting her back in one piece, that's all that matters. That's Very all I true. got for now. Good luck. All right. And that reminds me, we actually do need to go back to John E. Poole, as we've discovered who he is. Well, sort of. I still think he's the villain. Let's go back to him and find out who he really is. There we go. Thank you. Ah! Come on. There we go. Yeah. Da, 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 da. What is it now? I want the truth. Who are you really? I do not know what you mean. How come I found an ID that indicates you're Australian? Actually, never mind. All I really want to know is, where is Bess? I do not know where your friend is. That is the truth. Liar! This also is the truth. I'm not Jamaican. I'm from Australia. My real name's John Poole. Awesome. Now tell me something I don't know. I'm, or at least I was, an accountant. Only I discovered a bit too much about one of my dodgier clients. As a result, mm -hmm. he sent some henchmen after me to make sure I never tell the authorities. So now, wherever I go in order to survive, I change my name and my appearance. Or could it be about something else? That's why you followed me? You thought I was one of them? The guys who are after me? They're very smart and very determined. They'll stoop to anything, they'll stop at nothing. My only hope is to lie low, keep moving, and trust no one. Be nice if you could keep quiet about running into me. But that if you can't, you usually no say worries. Spies. As soon as I fix this engine, old Johnny Poole will be history. Sure. The other people you've seen on the island, are they the ones who are after you? Not a chance. If they were, me, you, they'd have done us all in first thing. My enemies are ruthless. I'm guessing those Ouch. people have got something to do with your missing friend. But if you think I'm going to help you find her, sorry, love. I've got my own problems. No more questions. Huru. Huru? What the heck does that mean? Oh, wait. Actually. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> I'm gonna turn around, go back, there we go. Cause we haven't gone over the task list in a while. Let's see. Check. Got his beacon back. Check. Climb the monolith. Still have to do that. Still oh, yeah. have to do that. Whatever I have to do to find this treasure. Okay. Yeah, we're gonna be that's those are the last two things that we're gonna be figuring out, sort of. Did that. All done. There we go. We got those done. Can't check that off yet. All done. Let's use the list of words and symbols that the beam of light ultimately pointed to. Okay. Check. Let's say about the ID. Check. Got the purge. Check. Got the driftwood. Uh, check. Check. All done. Check. Uh, now that I got those monkeys to move. I haven't done that. Right. Go to the highest point on the island. Right. Okay. So before we go to uh, the monolith, I want to write down those words. So let's put down caution, danger, Warning, and I'm gonna mark off those that are not on that are not listed in his and en journal entry 
death. Poisonous. Deep. Strike. Safe. Enter. Got it. So let's open the journal. And... Wait, where was it? Here it is. And lost their bearings. Danger. Heed this warning. Death. Awaits all who enter these caves and unprepared. Poisonous guardians. It's five and six. Of the deep strike. Seven, eight. With no warning. Nine. Stay away. Only those who follow the signs will find their way. Got it. Okay, so we don't need caution and we don't need safe. Let's look at those symbols again. Nope, that's the journal. <laughs> okay, so danger. It's kind of like a Z, but with a three-pronged mark. Warning is an upside down corn candy guardians <laughs> is the old rock symbol from last train to blue moon canyon except it's upside down death is five with a hook on one part and poisonous backwards j with a Dots deep. Um, that symbol. <laughs> I guess it's kind of like an a backwards N with a mark in the middle, sort of. Strike. What do you call that? An upside down one with an extra prong. I don't know. Boink and enter um what do you call that an awkward and sign sort of and i do believe that is all of them all right so let's go to the monolith bum ba dum I'm actually kind of excited about the next game because I know I've been telling you guys that it's not going to be Warnings of Waverly Academy which happens to be the next game uh, but wait is it Warnings of Waverly Academy? yeah it's not going to be Warnings of Waverly Academy but it's going to be uh, Resorts to Danger which is the last dossier game her interactive made. I am surprised I have not been hit yet. Do Ow do do Ow, that was my fault to do 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 I say Booyah. Okay.